The Nile River, it's a famous, very long river. What is the annual average discharge of the Nile River? It's not one of the major rivers. In terms of big rivers, important rivers, it's low on the volume of water being conveyed, if you want to put it that way. Well, that is probably because a lot of it is being absorbed into the sedimentary column that occupies the canyon. I will mention that if you look at maps, Egypt is the Nile Delta. It shows up very clearly. You'll notice that in, in the midst of all of this brown and barren, you've got this green Nile, right? And then you look at the alluvial fan here, the delta fan of this material, sedimentary material being carried out here, and it builds this fan-like structure, and you'll notice it's all green. Whatever the explanation for why the Mediterranean dried up, if that water is gone, now what happens is that will accelerate the downcutting to the base level. The base level is going to be the depth of the floor of the Mediterranean at the point where the Nile flows in. How is it that, it, that, that the entire Mediterranean Sea dried up? I don't know. So you had this ge a shift in geological epochs that seems to have this defining event.